And now, with its 2020 Local News First with WIBT News Director, Rick Brancadora. Delaware man with a 20-year history of driving violations was on a suspended license when he fatally struck two people in Wildwood last month, according to information at his detention hearing. WIBG's chief investigative reporter Linda Cohen says 37-year-old Gerald White will remain jailed after a detention hearing that included a list of driving history dating back to when he was 17. Now, Gerald White, who originally was announced as a Pittsburgh resident, actually lives in Delaware, where he is a caretaker for his mother, according to his defense attorney. He has two teenage daughters. They live with their mother. He now faces 16 charges in the September 24th incident that killed a pedestrian and a passenger in another vehicle. Well, with the merger of the John Brooks Recovery Center to Atlantic Care finalizing a deal to acquire it, it makes Atlantic Care and South Jersey's largest provider of mental health. According to Rob Zapor, the assistant VP of clinical services there, he says there's a lot going on here, and he says a lot of people will benefit because of the merger. And I think we've seen and noticed nationally that those numbers have risen even more since the COVID-19 pandemic. And so I think what, what we're seeing across our systems and the John Brooks system is that people are, are needing more intensive services and are, are oftentimes u- using substances that are much stronger and have much longer lasting effects on them. And so this coordination of care that we'll be able to offer between the Atlantic Care Health System and the services that John Brooks has been offering for years now is really going to be important to help us treat patients in an effective and efficient way. Okay, looks good. We're ready to go. Their frontier is the human brain and central nervous system, and their universe is the field of neurosurgery. At Atlantic Care, we treat complex brain tumors, stroke, and spinal disorders. Our surgeons are part of a team specially trained and skilled in sophisticated surgical procedures. They could have become rocket scientists, but their mission is to save lives. Got great news. He's going to be fine. Thank you, doctor. The region's only comprehensive. Here in South Jersey, our weather is always changing. That's why Nor'easter Nick is always there. I'm there when it matters most. Anytime, anywhere. And on any screen, so you know how to prepare. Tracking severe storms with the most powerful technology, so you're ready no matter where you live. Delivering the most accurate weather forecast on air, online, and on social media. Putting local first around the clock. Nor'easter Nick, South Jersey's weatherman. Serving by this is the Philadelphia Radio Legend, reborn in the Jersey Shore. This is WIBG. Local news you can depend on. Wibbage 2020 Local News First. Always there when you need us.